so uh, Supreme Master TV on this uh, DSP SDR thing uh, well, on telescopic antenna uh, one of the changes that I made because you guys now know that uh, I had problems with the charging which didn't work and after actually examining what was happening in there I decided to uh, simply have an external so I have a little hole that I drilled here and I put a USB cable which is connected to my battery pack here so this is going to be my new uh, way of powering this device um, you know what it's actually a good thing because the uh, battery pack will give me a lot of battery life so if I take this with myself go out for a full day I can actually have this working a full day and won't have to worry about battery life it's just gonna work so I'm happy with that actually it's gonna work so you know I've uh, settled for that the next step I'm gonna check um, if um, I'm capable because the USB-C port seems to be very bizarre and on computers so to update the firmware in this thing the computer needs to detect it and from what I've seen is I'm <laughs> trying a few cables no computers actually react to it I wonder if that USB-C port and, and its ter internal circuitry that controls it might not be problematic or something. Because, um, anyways, uh, if I can, I'll try to upgrade firmware, or else I'll be stuck with the, the demo firmware. I mean, it's not that it's uh, super bad, but uh, yeah, um, you know, getting the real thing would be probably better. So I'll be checking that out, anyways, in the next uh, few days. Uh, and hopefully maybe I'll be able to upgrade and of course it's kind of fun um, now I'm using it with an external battery pack yes it adds to it but you know um, the fact that I have a USB cable that comes out I can power it with pretty much anything uh, that has a USB port on it so it's pretty cool and I think it's going to be useful to uh, check that out so now running on this battery pack I can tell you I've been running this for at least uh, for at least I'd say a total of four to five hours right now and it actually is working pretty good uh, and the battery life you see that the battery pack is at 90 percent which is pretty amazing when you look at it so uh, anyways I'm gonna continue uh, checking it out so this is Supreme Master TV via WRMI 15770 uh, what you see here on the left is spurious signals from the internal circuitry because I'm using the telescopic whip but uh, kind of interesting to uh, continue testing this out. I'll post a few videos of reception, and uh, I'll I'll, um, I'll I'll take a look at my uh, personal kind of do a review. Uh, we'll talk about the problems I had, but I'll just kind of do a review of the receiver itself and how it works, and give you the performance uh, that I uh, I get out of it. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.